Hey, hello guys. Oh, this is the Redmi Note 10. Okay. <coughs> and we have successfully installed the custom recovery. And so it means that we can root it root this one and customize this one. Okay. Uh, you can apply this tutorial on two type of Xiaomi phone, the Redmi Note 10 with the code name Sunny and Mojito. Okay. So in this tutorial, I will show you how to unlock bootloader respawn, uh, flash the custom recovery, and flash the custom ROM. Okay, we're going to use the pixel experience. <coughs> okay. So experience Android 11. Okay, make sure follow all the steps uh, because it will. If we follow all the steps, uh, maybe you will get fail. Okay, all the files and instruction I'll provide it in my blog, and it will be provide. I will provide the link in the description box. Okay, so check it out guys this rom is very nice and very fast uh, i will very recommend recommend this one okay i will make also a quick review about this rom uh, is it worth it or not for daily driver okay so stay tuned and check it out okay hello guys assalamualaikum we meet again with unbox this time we have the super pond. Okay. It's in my hand. This is the Red Note 10. Okay. This is the ordinary Note 10. With the code name is Sunny or Mojito. Okay. Sunny or Mojito is, is the same hardware. Okay. Okay. Let's switch screen okay let's show okay. let's go to the settings right here and uh, button okay you see it is probably not bad missing me global 12 and missing android 11 Okay, otherwise it's in auto focus. <laughs> okay, so it's using the <coughs> Red 11. Okay, and let's open the ID64. Systems, uh, let's see. It has 4 gigs of RAM and 60, 64 gigs of internal storage. Okay, with the code name is sunny and it's the same as Mojito. Okay, let's go back. Let's check this view using the Qualcomm Snapdragon 675. Okay, and using the 16-4 bit arms. Okay, so we're going to try to unlock this one and <clears throat> and try to customize. So, custom ROM okay we're going to use the pixel experience okay so for continue make sure you have a coupon set the account that's it yeah the me account go to the mail on unlock and wait for seven days okay it has been seven days now this point is ready to be unlocked okay uh, it has not been unlocked so it's still not open okay now oh. Let's hit the unlock button. Okay, and let's wait for five seconds. Then hit unlock again. 
Uh, with that, it will unlock the panel Okay, so I don't want to put it into the the tom screen, so I'm going to press the pull down. Okay, so it will boot again to the press boot mode. Okay, okay, let's close this one. Now we are in the unlock state. Okay. Okay, let's get the screen again. Where is it? Okay. Let's set the unlock state. Password, space, or space device. That's simple. Okay, as you can see now, all one has been unlocked. And let's step some other comment. That's good. Uh, that far. Okay. We're using the Note 10. You me Note 10, Sunny or Mojito. Okay. It's same. Thing. Okay. Uh, now, <clears throat> now we want to boot into the custom recovery. Okay. Open the command prompt and let's open the file manager. Okay. For this form, we can directly flash the custom recovery. So, step is we have to boot into the custom recovery first and then we can flash the custom recovery. Okay. So, the steps. <clears throat> okay. So, Five press boot space boot space and we're going to use the RP okay the RP 3.5.1 number SP okay you can write I'm done <clears throat> okay now it's going to go to the some recovery okay now we are in the custom recovery but because we cannot <coughs> with the internal storage so we have to move this file into a sd card or usb otg okay Use this one. Let's use the screen first. Okay. Okay. I will set the display. Uh, where is it? There? Brightness. Okay. Okay. Then. <clears> hey, <throat> okay, I have copied the. Uh, IRP into the USB flash drive. Oh, sorry, I'm going to use, use this one because I have micro USB in here. Okay. And then let's plug in to the USB C connector. Hmm. So that. Like, you can always use the micro SD. Okay, I forgot where I put the micro SD. Right, this. Okay, let's put it in here. Let's put it down. <clears throat> <clears throat> then you need to go to the advanced here. Okay, advanced menu and go to the install recovery RAM disk. Can you see the menu? Install recovery RAM disk. Okay, select this one and select where you put the RP. Okay, because we are using the OTG, let's try to select storage here and select USB OTG. 
expand folder put it in here and let's like the file okay and then just swipe it will flash the customer can be okay so it will make the file there will be permanent now we sorry i mean <clears throat> and after this the, there will be it will be permanent okay you can access the custom recovery using the power and form Okay, now it's done. The home button, we're going to wipe data. Okay, so wipe format data type yes. Okay, <clears throat> and go home. And it's a good habit to back up the file. Okay, yes, I back up to the option and I will compression. Okay, I want to back up the USB OTG and let's back up the <clears throat> EFS and um, okay better save than sorry okay Okay, it's done. <clears throat> let's hit the home button and <clears throat> let's try to access the custom recovery uh, using the button. Okay, like reboot and power off. Going to test the custom recovery. Is it accessible or permanent? Okay. <laughs> oh, one is already turned off. Let's press the pluma up and power button. Okay. Okay, three seconds. One, two, three, one, two, three. Okay. Okay. Nice. So now we have a permanent custom recovery. Okay, it seems that I have to set the display again. The brightness okay <clears throat> and now <clears throat> we're going to plug the cable again cable in here put it down and let's enable adb set lot okay go to the advanced select adb set lot okay put it down pawn let's switch the screen again <clears throat> okay now we are going to Install the custom recovery okay. pixel experience. Okay. We use this one. Okay, you can always flash using the pen drive or the SD card. Yeah, I will. I want to show you using the ADB set load. Okay, let's see the command ADB space site load, and then just click and drag the file. Okay, enter. We'll wait <clears throat> mm. 
Okay, all the uh, custom recovery and the uh, custom ROM. It's you can use it for the uh, Mi Note 10. Okay, the Sunny and the Mojito is the same firmware. And all the credit goes to the Pixel Experience teams and let me not 10 Indonesian Telegram channel. Okay, so give a big thumb to them. <laughs> okay, let's wait. Okay, just for your information, <clears throat> the custom ROM using is Pixel Experience and it's using the Android 11. Okay, and because it's Pixel Experience, it's also included the gaps, so you don't need to flash the gaps again because it's already included. And the size is <clears throat> about one and a half gigs. Okay. <clears throat> and also the, the information this process will not go into the 100 100% okay uh, I'm not mistaken it's just goes to the 45% okay and then it will stop but it's okay it's expected because it has been finished so don't worry it's not it's not corrupted or whatever it's it's doing fine okay as I told you before it will stop in 45 I'm sorry 47 percent ADB failed to read comment or error blah 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 okay it's expected so don't worry just need to close this one and hit the boot system okay reboot system swipe it Okay. 
will take some time to loot the loot logo okay as you can see <clears throat> now it's changing from the new loot logo into the experience loot logo Okay, now we are in the Android palm, uh, wizard palm screen. Okay, okay let's, let's, let's start. Let's get this one. Let's set the top line. <clears throat> okay now we are in the under the thumb screen okay that's very smooth okay i will stop this video and we'll make a quick review about this one okay guys okay guys so this is the pixel experience okay we have successfully customize our Xiaomi Redmi Note 10 okay now it's using the visual experience uh, custom ROM okay we're going to make a quick review about this ROM okay uh, we're going to take a review about the images uh, the GPS the camera and sound and video okay is it uh, worth it for daily driver or not okay let's check it out okay first thing uh let's install some apps okay <coughs> we want to install i have copied some apk to this one okay let's install the maps okay let's install the maps okay done checker this for fun <laughs> then and maybe safety net okay but it's not required because the mages the latest mages mages 23 is already fixed the safety net test okay let's close the apps okay first thing we need to do is open the mages okay let's go to the settings and Make sure you have enabled the menu side, okay. Then go back, okay. You want to check the safety net, <coughs> okay. Nice. So the safety net says that we have succeed. The basic integrity, the city's profile, and evaluation type basic is passed, so you can safely use banking apps, uh, Google Pay. Hailing right, such as project grab, uh, Uber, and etc. Okay, that's nice. And now let's test the GPS. Okay, let's try open the maps. <coughs> Give it permission. Okay, very fast. Okay, you can see it's load loading the map very fast and it has a small blue dots okay it means the gps is locking so it's very nice okay so you can safely use for the navigation such as local direction or uh, waste or whatever okay and if you're online driver like Gojek, grab uber it's very useful okay and now let's test the camera. <clears throat> okay, we want to test the camera. Okay, this is the back camera. Uh, we're going to take a shot. Okay. <clears throat> 
and let's take test of the front camera okay where is it uh, this one okay <laughs> okay and it seems that the two camera is working let's check the gallery This is uh, so. This is the front camera. Not the best, but quite decent. You can always use Google Maps. Uh, sorry, <laughs> uh, Google Cam Cam for the best result. Okay, maybe I will share the Cam files in my blog. So please check the description box. Okay, and this is the back camera. Okay, seems that all working. like a video maybe take a video where is video okay this one okay uh, sorry video okay now I'm taking a video from this one okay let's check if it's working or not uh, okay let's stop it Okay, this one. Seems that kind of lagging. Okay, let's take another test. Okay, testing, testing, test. This is a test. Recording video from the Pixel Experience ROM. Okay, stop this one. HVR is not supported. Okay, it seems that we have to set. Okay, whatever it's working. <laughs> okay, now let's we're going to test the sound video. <coughs> let's open the YouTube. Okay. Uh, okay, let's. one maybe okay quite nice the video is very nice song can you hear the song <coughs> Okay, very nice. So the sound and video is working very well. Okay, and let's take a real test just for fun. <coughs> Granted. Okay, your M two one blah 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 is with the okay nice. <laughs> okay, so that's all guys. Uh, so we have doing. Unlock bootloader for this one, and then blasting custom recovery, blasting the custom ROM, and make a quick review about this one. Okay, we have testing the mages. Okay, it's working. The sound and video is working very well. The camera is working properly, and the GPS is very fast and long. Okay, so for the verdict is, I think this ROM is very nice. Very snappy, better than the stock ROM. Can use it uh, 
for the daily labor okay <clears throat> okay that's all I hope uh, this video is useful for you if you find it useful please hit the like button okay <laughs> and if you subscribe you will get notified when I'm uploading a video okay I have a last video about routing and custom ROM uh, if you like please check my other video okay uh, all the files and instruction I will provide it in the description box so check the description box it will link to my blog okay that's all guys thank you very much have a nice day wassalamualaikum